What's going on adventurers? Welcome to the Villa b and in Daytona Beach, Florida. This place is absolutely amazing. And you know what the best part is? It's haunted. And of course, you guys know, this is Patty from the G-Team. Hi everyone. So guys, right here where that yellow flag is, that is the master suite. That's where we're actually staying currently. And this little balcony over here, that is the balcony right outside of our room. And there is a double hot tub out there which is pretty awesome. We didn't get the chance to use it, but um, like I said previously, we will definitely be back. And next time we're gonna bring some peeps with us. Yes. I mean, yeah, this is definitely a castle. Spinning. Did it again. I did this earlier oh, when we first got here when we were putting our stuff away. I'm so glad it did it on camera. Oh my god. And that one actually came open earlier too. We're hoping that that happens again. I hope. It's starting to storm outside, Jen. I was just uh, showing this lawn. Look at this. There's a bad storm coming in. Look at that door. See, that's like the third wow. time now that's happened, and we just turned our cameras on in the room. We've been trying to get everything situated and, and everything. Now, this is a very haunted room right here. This room here, someone stayed in here for a while, and while in here, they experienced the lights going on and off quite a bit. I will have him tell the story here in a little bit about the uh, situation that happened with the woman that was in this room. I believe you said she was here for two weeks. I believe so. No. Like, another thing, yeah, another thing I wanted to say was why we were getting ready to film. This chandelier here has been flickering as well as the bathroom light, so. And that even started before, way before the storm. Did yeah, it did. Time. Oh, it just did it. Can you flicker the light for us? I have the REM pod in the middle of the bed as well. Can you please flicker the lights again? Is that you, Florence? Can you maybe make the chandelier move? I felt the cold breeze when I said that. Did you? Yeah. I think she's definitely here. There's a device in the middle of the bed that you can make light up. If you would go over there close to it, it will light up in all kinds of pretty colors. Could you do that for us, please? Can I just say how beautiful this room is? <laughs> this room is absolutely beautiful. It really is. This whole hotel is beautiful. Yeah, you definitely, if you're going to be in the Daytona Beach area, you definitely need to stay here. Yes, for sure. And make sure you tell them that G-Team Paranormal and Raptor Adventures sent you. And they will give you a 25% discount, guys. Yes. Pretty much getting started. We've had to get things set up and situated. Uh, we sat with the owners for about an hour and a half. Right now I have a trigger object, which is a glass of wine. It is believed that this woman in white that walks these stairs likes wine, possibly, because she has shown herself when they were all sitting around the table down here having wine a couple of times. So um, I've got a glass of wine as a tr trigger object, and I'm going to set it right here. 
after I take a sip of it. <laughs> it got to prime it. Would you oh, like it? What just I happened? I saw that. that. I'm going to my glasses on. Like, the lights are going crazy going in the other room. They've been going crazy for a while. Um, but right now I have the REM pod right here. I have my K2 meter right there. I think you can probably see it all on the camera. Jen is going to turn the Necrophonic app on right now. We're going to try to find out what this woman's real name is and the man that's here as well. Oh, that's better. Leave? Please leave. Did you hear it? I said please leave. Actually, we'd like to stay and we'd like to talk to you. What is your name? Heat. 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 We're hot. We're like really hot. Sweating. Why are we so hot right now? Hot. Burn. That's it. Florence, are you hearing us? I'm behind you. Yep, I heard that. I'm I heard there. that. It was like a, it sounded like a but... Uh, yeah. What? <laughs> Florence, can you move through those lights right there? Come down these stairs and come real close to this wine glass right here. I poured you a glass of wine. Set. I'm coming. I said I heard her say we know them too. Did you hear that? So we sat down for a minute at the table, guys, and he just brought out our hors d'oeuvres. We're going to show you that in a minute. Uh, we noticed, Patty actually noticed that this lamp was moving, and it still is. We just wanted to show you that. Wow, that is so cool. And uh, he said actually that he has never noticed that happening before. So I think, I think they wanted to talk to us, huh, Patty? Pretty good? Wow. Yeah. Complete with a glass of Pinot Grigio. Wow. We're getting spoiled tonight. We are getting spoiled. <laughs> but there's going to be some awesome videos for you guys. And I hope a lot of you do decide to come visit the Villa B&B &B because it really is an amazing experience. We haven't even been here that long. And we're just, our, I mean, we're just yeah. static. So. And it's moving. Check it's it out, guys. Time. The REM pod just came on and that lamp is still moving. 
laying it all the way around. Wow, it's going crazy. Wow, yes it is. That's a lot of energy right there. That is a lot of energy. Light the whole thing up. You know, that button to the left, that's what that does is kind of gives it a, you know, restart. And Patty keeps resetting it and it just keeps going off. Look at that. Look at that. Wow. And the lamp up here keeps flickering as well. Let's see if it'll do it. That is going crazy. Wow, this is definitely one. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh god. Can you turn it back on? Oh us, my god. <laughs> Are you going to turn the light back on? Please turn the light back on for us. It's a good night. Did it say good night? Does that mean you're going to leave them off? Guys, this is crazy. These lights are going off and on like nobody's business. I've never experienced this level of haunting ever. I keep feeling like somebody's watching me right now. Crazy. You alright? Yeah. I was telling everybody that you were feeling a little nauseous from all the yeah. excitement.
Okay guys, it is the very next day. We woke up to a delicious aroma. We came downstairs to this. Okay guys, this is the lovely living room. It is absolutely stunning. You can see they have the beams and the ceiling. The awesome fireplace. Very cozy in there at night. Um, chandeliers are stunning. It's just a great room to chill out and you know, just relax a little bit and talk with your friends, family, whoever happens to be here with you. Jimmy tell you guys a little bit about there because again it's completely that was this off. one. Oh, oh my god it went completely off that I gotta get the K2 meter. We did not even have the chance to get in the pool as beautiful and relaxing as it looks. We just we've been so busy filming and taking pictures and uh, live streaming and all that good stuff but like I said we're coming back and when we do you better believe we are going to be taking a lot of time to enjoy the pool. Obviously this is the outside of the house. They have a beautiful fountain here in the courtyard. Plenty of places to sit and lounge. Right up there is the master suite where we were staying. I believe that's the window to the bathroom and the closet. They have a huge closet where you can put all of your stuff. There are the beautiful windows right there, those three that go up the grand staircase. They have these beautiful lion and tiger statues. take you guys back into the house with me and this is the way you go in oh wow a locust look at this that's crazy all right guys so we're a little sad right now because it has come time for us to leave this beautiful yeah. oasis of happiness and seclusion <laughs> Uh, truthfully, I mean, this place is so amazing. We got so much activity here, more than I've ever seen. I mean, Patty's seen it before. Yeah. But, you know, this was the first time for me, so it was really incredible. And honestly, we can't say enough about how amazing and hospitable uh, the hosts, John and Jimmy, are. I mean, they're just, they're wonderful. So it's safe to say we're going to be back soon. Definitely. And we're going to say it again. Be sure to tell them that Raptor Adventures and the G-Team sent you because they're going to give you guys 25% off and that is such a great deal. So with that being said, guys, we'll see you on our next Raptor Adventure.